Hi guys, Liz here. Happy Monday to you. Well, there is snow outside still, lots of it. And this girl is loving the spring on the inside of her house. So I'll tell you what we're gonna do today. We're gonna decorate two shelves in the kitchen for spring, as well as the top of a small cabinet that goes just beneath the shelves. And it's gonna be so, 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 so cute. Can we all say it together? Cute, cute, cute. Let's do this. Always wipe your furniture down so that you have a nice clean slate in which to work with. I love clean furniture, I do. So right before Christmas, I hauled these cute little wreaths that I got at Home Goods, and I took the prices off so I don't remember what they cost, but I like to add lots of different textures and colors. So I have put a little nail here and one up there, and I'm just gonna simply hang these. Done. So we're gonna work on the bottom shelf first, and I got this little cake platter at um, Home Goods, and let's see, yeah, it was $7.99. I got this, I don't know, a couple years ago, but they always sell these there. In fact, I saw some there last week that had like pink ribbon, uh, pastel ribbons for spring, so, but you can always find usually one with the black ribbon. Um, which I love. So, anyway, we're going to put this right here. And I want to add a little bit of a height. So I've got this little basket. And then I got a cute little yellow tea towel. And I have filled this with faux lemons. Is that not cute for spring? This can morph on into summer as well. Imagine a cute little lemonade sign next to this. Anyway, I'm going to place this right here. That is so cute, 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 cute. So I have shared this before. You can get a cake platter at Walmart, at Target, at Ross. Ross has these for really cheap, all day long usually. And I think that's where I got this one. But anyway, I have shared these before. These are my faux muffins. These are in, linked in my Amazon store. I will link that in the description box below in case you guys would like to get these. But these are awesome. You get all of these and they look like real muffins. Check it out. By the way, they're uh, magnetic. So I've heard like a lot of people um, in coffee shops get these and they get like a magnetic board and then they just, they just click right on and they can stack them like a bunch of really cute stacked muffins. But um, they smell like real legit muffins and they're squishy, check it out. They're squishy like real muffins. Is that not cool or what? Check it out. All right, so I'm gonna take this and place this right here. Let's turn this down. So I'm gonna put this kind of center stage. And then I got this little box, a uh, rustic box at uh, Home Goods. No, no, not Home Goods. I take that back. Hobby Lobby, and I got it last year on clearance for $6.25. Not bad, not bad, right? And I just put some garden balls in there. And you guys see this um, switch right there? I don't like it. I don't wanna see it, I don't like it there. So I'm gonna put this in front of it to conceal it. Take my little box here. And then I'm gonna place this right there. Take my garden ball and set it right beside it. So, I think that makes for a very cute spring display. Let's do the next shelf. Okay guys, I hauled this for you right before Christmas. I got these, this bread. Uh, from Hobby Lobby, got it like 75% off, I believe. And I love adding faux food to my displays. So, 
I've got this basket here and I just put a cute little tea towel kind of off to the side. And now I'm gonna place the bread in the basket. So, right, super cute. And I'm just gonna set it right here. So I've got this little sign, it says sweet tea and sunshine. And I'm just gonna place this right here, just like that. And then I have this, uh, this goes to a little close, and I just put some of this little stuff in it. And then I found this at Walmart, and I just tied a little yellow ribbon around the little cow's neck. The cow, a pig, and a rooster. How cute, right? In keeping with kind of the farmhouse or French country theme, I'm just gonna place this right here. Isn't that cute? I'm bringing you a little closer. So there's the bottom shelf. There's the middle shelf. And now let's go work on that top shelf. So I have this sign, this chalkboard, and I put Southern Living in Virginia. And I'm gonna place it right, hold on. Gotta get up on my chair. I'm just gonna place it right up here. Like so. The last two items I have, um, I've got this greenery and I put some little white flowers in it. Um, I forgot where I bought this, it was most likely Home Goods. And then um, I just found these little white flowers at Hobby Lobby and just stuck it directly in the center. But I like it because it looks like it's the start of spring with the little blooms coming out. And then I had the letter R for our last name. And I got this at TJ Maxx for $7.99. So, let's do this. Let's put, sorry guys, let's put this right here. Let me point you up. Here's the letter R, and I think I'm just gonna lean it like that. Done. So that's it guys. I hope you like it. I think it ties in beautifully with the kitchen. And uh, here you can see my kitchen real fast. And there's my, all my vignettes. Love, love, love. Those are my two favorite words. Cute, 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 and love, love, love. Forgot to say, I got this cute sign at, um, where'd I get it? Hobby Lobby. Isn't it cute? I just love it. So I'll be incorporating this somewhere in my kitchen. So be on the lookout for it. All right, guys, well, that will do it for me today. Um, oh, I wanna thank you guys so much for all your sweet comments yesterday uh, because I was kind of taking care of my daughter. I was running up and down stairs all day yesterday, um, keeping her hydrated and that temperature down. Um, I did read all your comments. I just didn't get to respond to a lot of you, a lot, a lot, a lot of you. <laughs> but um, I thank you guys so much for your sweet comments and all of your prayers. I, it really, it means so much to me. She's doing slightly better today, uh, pretty much sleeping a lot. So. I hear sleep is sometimes the best thing for you. So anyway, guys, I'm going to wrap this video up and just let you know. Love y'all. Love y'all. Love you all. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Have a great evening. Mwah!